Howdy folks, Max and McGee here sitting down with Henry Gilbert, and today, Henry, you're gonna tell me all about every- we're gonna go through all 50 <laughs> of the big announcements from yesterday's video. Well, that's a lot. I know, that maybe- maybe that's a bit too many. Let's just start with eight player battles. Uh, you got to play it. Is it as completely chaotic and overwhelming as it looks at first blush? Uh, yes. Yes it is, okay. but that's a good thing in my mind. So, yeah, I, I sat down at, at, uh, at a pre-release event and they had eight GameCube controllers set up, which is just insane to just see on like right. a giant coffee table. <laughs> and we were playing on a TV that had to be at least 60 inches big. Like, it was a big HD TV. And even then, it was still just like, oh, where am I? Where? What's, what color am I? Oh, I'm player five. I'm over there. Okay. Like, and especially at the um, character selection screen, just seeing eight different Little hands. icons all just yeah, floating just. around the screen. Like, which, uh, which stages did you play on? Uh, so there's only so many. I, I there's uh, just a handful of stages that they've expanded to the size. Okay, yeah, I was gonna everybody. ask, like, do they adjust at all to? Yeah, there's for there are people. some extra big stages. Like, there there was uh, the Palutena's Temple stage. Mm -hmm. There was uh, the new stage they showed off yesterday that had those those um, like instant death spots that if you're over a hundred. Oh like, right. The, those and those are needed because a lot of those big stages, if they're multi-layered. You can't really do like a, a smash that knocks you off the top of the screen. You'll just hit the top. So now you can hit those those things, and they'll just instantly kill you. But uh, you can also just get lost in the architecture of it, or just hide out pretty easy in a stock battle. And and you'll what I was noticing was there were a lot of like little matchups going on of like three people here, two mm -hmm. people there. And eventually, we just all come in the middle. Well, meanwhile, we we did play on one regular size stage, which was uh, a Yoshi stage from Super Mario World. Okay. And it was so crowded, like we were all just like, "What's going on?" Is oh that the God, one that's ah. just like the one platform with the little crooked one, platform on top of it? One platform with then like two um, uh, green pipes on each side. Oh, okay. Like, just okay. it like. So it was this weird, like, kind of, like, U-shape that was just mm. keeping everybody together. And, yeah, we were just, like, bouncing off each other the whole time until, until it was just down to four, and then it got normal. Did you play stock or did you play time? I uh, did both, and I definitely preferred stock for it. Like, time is just too crazy because you always have eight people. Because <laughs> it's always insanity. It seems like stock would be more interesting because you start out with this crazy amount of people, and then it sort of whittles down and sort of the dynamic of the battle changes. Mm -hmm. And you get to see, like, who's the better survivor and stuff, and... and and yeah, so it is crazy, but I like the craziness. Like, I like the insanity of Smash Brothers and how unpredictable it is. Like, some people, I don't like when people try to make Smash Brothers like a regular fighting game because to me, it's not. Like, it is craziness. It is having somebody throw a bomb at you that you then reflect back at the guy, like, <laughs> right. half across the stage. Like, and that's what the, the eight player does. Like, it, it ratchets it up. I think maybe really six players will be the sweet spot of like, this is just crazy enough, but not too insane. And also, like, how many people are going to have, like, eight players around all the time? I'm just trying to visualize the, the tentacled monster of a Wii U it must have been with, like, the two GameCube controller adapters and then eight cords just running every which eight way. Eight cords everywhere. Yeah, it was nuts. The, the, I, uh, my absolute favorite to play on because it was my favorite stage in Melee mm -hmm. was the Hyrule stage. The, right. Because it, it is very multi-tiered. Yeah, it's pretty much the same size in, in this game as it was in Melee. And it, yeah, it's multi-tiered. There's like really three different arenas within this one thing. Right. And so it used to be, you know, somebody could just hang out on the bottom while the other three were fighting. Now it's like th two people fighting in that little alcove while everybody else is up top. And it was just enough space. Like, I really loved playing in that stage. How was the, uh, I imagine the camera must have had to be zoomed it's out. It's zoomed really out as far there. as it can go. Like, you have very small figures. Mm -hmm. Like, I mean, you will lose track of yourself. Like, that. that's just going to happen at least the first few times you play it. Like, I do think you'll get used to it enough, and you'll be like, I know what, uh, I mean, you're just going to have to get used to Oh, what color and number am I? Because right. I'm gonna, you're gonna find am that. Am I the before little red blob or am I the little orange blob? And it does make item pickups kind of hard in in the really zoomed out stages. Right. Mario Galaxy wasn't a bad one either. That was cool to play it. But uh, but yeah, so really crazy, but really fun. And and I am 
I am looking forward to it, but I think it'll be an acquired taste for most people because right. I do think you'll be able to do, you can do eight players if you just have, you have the four GameCube controllers, and then you're just going to have to add the pro controllers to everybody else. Okay. But at the very least, you can do five players, and like, I think we've all had it where, oh, let's play four-player Smash, and then there's a fifth person. Yeah, and the odd man out. They just kind of have to sit there like, okay, okay I'll wait okay. for my turn. <laughs> now they can finally join in. And then one more thing I wanted to ask about that. In the 3DS version, you can uh, you can tap on your character's like profile picture uh, mm. during a match, and it'll put like the little rainbow box around them to help you see where you are. Right. Is there anything uh, like that? Not that I saw. No. I'm. You can use the you can use the Wii U gamepad screen just as uh, to to show percentages of people right, that right, are right. damaged. But that's pretty much it, and I really don't think you could play that. You, I, I don't think you could effectively play the eight-player mode with one person playing off the gamepad, like <laughs> watching the action on there. Like, they would just be specs. But I saw a lot more than the eight-player mode in the game. If you want to see everything that I saw at Smash Brothers Wii U, go to GamesRadar.com to check it out.